Pillow fight, pillow fight. Now this is epic. I pull up. I didn't even know he could do that. I told you guys, I told you. Look at my beautiful wife. And he's gonna beat Jake Paul and Logan Paul in the ring. What's up all you epic Minecraft, imposter, Amoga, sus, Fortnite, RuneScape Club, Penguin, Skyrim, Toon Towns, Wizard 101, sisters? It's me, James Chungus. Today I have a very exciting video for all of you guys. Uh, Kevin's aggressive again because it's a new day and it's almost like his aggression resets every day. But also Poggers found out how to open their little thing there. And I just decided to let them graze for a bit because Karen and Kevin eat this grass and it's getting a little long. It's supposed to rain again quite a bit in a few hours. I'm gonna go ahead and we'll set up this little canopy with the little pool noodles that you guys suggested on the subreddit. Oh, here come all the chickens to poop on the porch again. Get out of here, gamer. Come on, go. Check this out, guys. This is my new grill. You can cook things on it. I'm gonna cook some eggs on here later. It was cheaper than literally every other grill at Costco, probably because it requires log. I'm gonna hit you with a pillow. Oh, come on, go. Whoa, is that the baby hopping up to me in my very own backyard? Sir, I'm very excited to see your performance at ACL. Pay attention to me. Notice me, senpai. See, with this new fencing, Kevin can't hurt himself. He can bite this fencing all he wants. He can put his head over it and go crazy and angry. He can try and push it over, but he won't hurt himself regardless, no matter what. Check this out. And all Uncle Ben has to do to get his scores. <laughs> okay, this doesn't work very well at all. He's just grabbing the pillow. Um, why is he going around in a little circle like this? Like he's just running in a circle. Oh, that was odd. Hey, Kevin, pillow fight. <laughs> Pillow fight, pillow fight. This is not animal abuse. Pillow fight, 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 pillow fight. This is gonna break the pillow. Pillow fight, pillow fight, pillow fight. Come on, Kevin, get out. It definitely doesn't hurt him at all. Oh, but it worked. Look, it worked. Yes. Karen is my wife now, Kevin. Pillow fight. Wow, it works. Okay, cool. And now we can do the chores. Kevin, hey. <laughs> Pillow fight. Kevin and I get in a sussy pillow fight. Slap. Look at Morgan turning into an adult goose. Kevin, hey. <laughs> pillow fight. Interesting. Look at this little pile of Darcidious poops. I wonder if he laid those all at once or if it took him a little while to make that little collection. Good morning, sir. It's time for your breakfast. See, I told you guys. I told you guys. I told you. I literally, I freaking told you. Darcidious and I are now friends. And it only took a couple months. I pull up. Karen, come here. She responds to her name now. Look at my beautiful wife. Come on, Karen. Oh, this is a safe place for you, Darcidious. Oh, yeah. Look how cute he is. Look at that beautiful little tumorous face. Hey, you guys know what these little spots are on his feet? Are those just freckles? Gave these guys a little scoop in there. I'm going to give them a few more scoops throughout the day, but I'm also going to let them free range today. Kevin, hey, here, have this. Oh, oh. see, guys, it's working. Watch this. He'll, 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 oh, see, he's learning that biting doesn't help. Biting doesn't do a thing, Mr. Kevin. Here, have a bite. Oh, you dropped it. Oh no, better bend over and pick up this little thing here. Sure hope this man doesn't. Pillow fight. We like to have fun here at the Urban Rescue Ranch. We like to have little pillow fights every now and then. <laughs> see, he knows. Oh, it looks like Vinny's chewing on that little thing over there. Okay, we'll see if we have any other guys over here. Whoa, was that the baby chewing on a little branch that fell on the ground? Oh, sir, what is that? That looks quite delicious, sir. Would you mind if I perhaps had just a little bit? Oh, he's holding it with his little hand. I didn't even know he could do that. Look at this man. I swear, this man does not think about a single thing on this earth. He just like to chew and eat and perhaps nibble a little bit. Leave a like if you think we should make it the baby eating ASMR channel. I think that would do well. Look at this little face. Oh. Look at this beautiful man. Oh, look at his little chest and his little arm. I could do this all day. He heard a little thunder and he just stood up and like looked over here. All right, the baby, come on, let's go in the backyard. Come on, buddy. Come on, the baby, let's go. Let's go, buddy. It's time to go into the backyard, sir. <laughs> oh, he's hugging me. This is a beautiful little man. Although I do think he's trying to bite in some way. I think he's trying to like fight. Yeah, yeah, he is. The baby's first fight. He's squaring up. Look at this little man. Look at him trying to fight me. <laughs> Look at him trying to grab me. This is the most perfect, beautiful little man that I've ever seen. Oh, don't, oh look at him. Oh, I'm gonna rub your belly. Oh, whoa. Hit rapper and artist to baby always packing heat and exercising his ow. Oh, he just bit me. He gave me a little love play bite. Oh. Look at him. Look at him. 
You guys, this is it. This marks the beginning of a very long journey with the baby and I, where I will be training him to fight Jake and Logan Paul. That's right. The baby is going to learn to box and fight, and he's going to beat Jake Paul and Logan Paul in the ring. <laughs> is he? He's trying. Okay, that's different. Now this is epic. Man, can you guys imagine when the baby just gets massive? That's going to be incredible. That's going to be incredible. And I'm going to be here every step of the way with you, sir. I'm going to be training you every step of the way. My adorable little beautiful man. You are going to be very large and we're going to train you. And he's going to have a whole two acres to run around on in Waco. Now I can let all these chicks free range without having to worry about them coming over here, pooping all over the port. I don't even have to spray down little the baby's poops because they're perfect fertilizer and they're just these little pellets. I do have to spray down these poggers poops, but we'll save that for Marison. <laughs> How's about you guys comment, Marison is not based and poop-pilled in the comments. It looks like Morgan's just genuinely happy to be playing and hanging out with the chicks again. That is his flock, after all. Okay, looks like the chickens are going back into their coops. I'm going to go close it. And I'm going to actually let the baby here for a bit, even though he's going to poop a little bit on the porch. Uh, we do need something to trim all this grass here. And somebody's about to get locked back in. Okay, so you guys all said, look at Vinny trying to chew that stuff. But you got tons of hay to chew on over there. So apparently I can put these little pool noodles up and I can put them up in here. This will keep it from bowing down and collecting all the rainwater. Now I believe this is how you do it. Okay, rain's coming down now really hard, but I figured it out. I'll spread them out like that. And that's right, that keeps it from bowing. If this breaks, I'm just gonna end up taping it to the bottom here. See if I can just grab this. Oh, and this so far like kind of keeps this dry, but not really. Okay, I saw lightning, so I'm getting out of here so Karen and Kevin can get under here. And the baby, the dingus that he is, went over here to get out of the rain. Well, that's Texas in late spring for you guys. Be sunny one second and flooding the next. Poggers has that little area there so he can sit down. And the reason why I keep Poggers out in the rain, you're probably thinking, oh, Uncle Ben, bring Poggo in. I could, but also I want him to be out there and protect them even when it's raining. I want them to feel comfortable with Pogger's presence. You see how those little chicks are trapped in there? Because he's there and it's raining, they're gonna sit there and stay with him. Morgan and Darcidius, on the other hand, are just gonna end up loving this because they're waterfowl. I'm gonna go ahead and set the pool out there and then I'm not even gonna have to worry about filling it up. Lightning definitely just struck somewhere very, very close. Got this little kale greens for uh, the baby Kevin man. Put some kale greens in here so that little baby Kevin can eat. I also put a little bit in here for young Olive. Okay, the rain seems to have subsided. Look how happy they all are. I'm off to go get a P.O. box set up. It is really coming down in buckets over here, guys. Guess we're not going to rescue those turtles today. Next video. But I need to set up that P.O. box and drop off this package for Josephine from Los Angeles. Good thing is I can go out the easy way. All right, we got the P.O. box. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Don't forget to sub to our subreddit. Oh, I almost forgot. To ah!